Hello, hypertension resistors. So today I want to talk to you about how to log blood pressure readings. This is step three if you're looking to get better control of your blood pressure or even if you're looking to get off of blood pressure medication now. Just remember now, I mean, usually once you're on blood pressure medication, you'll be on it for the rest of your life. And that's what we know based on research. But however, we do know that some people do manage to get off of blood pressure medication if they do certain things. This is one of the steps that you can use in order to help your doctor better manage your blood pressure, as well as help your doctor wean you off of blood pressure medication if this is appropriate for you. If you go to your healthcare provider, if you go there with all these sheets of paper, disorganized and just, um, you know, many different, you know, blood pressure readings for months and months. I mean, that is a lot to look at in a few minutes that your healthcare provider uh, have in order to <laughs> treat your blood pressure. So it might be best to find an app to log your blood pressure into that app. And that way, it only takes 30 seconds at the most for your healthcare provider to take a look at the log and see if your blood pressure is controlled or not. So I find it that a app is the best way to keep your log. Now, if that is not what your healthcare provider would prefer or you would prefer, then get a pocket calendar where you, that you can get from the dollar store, you know, and you can just log your blood pressures into that pocket calendar. If you're using a notebook, put the date first and then the time followed by the blood pressure and the heart rate. So, it's very important to log your blood pressures and share those with your healthcare provider so that you can get the right treatment. Basically, you can live a healthier, longer life if you take action when your blood pressure is uncontrolled. So make sure you show up at your visit with your blood pressure log. <laughs> That's all I have for you today. Stay tuned to Hypertension Resistant to Treatment, where I'll tell you more about what everybody ought to know about hypertension and about trending topics. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you in the next one.